What's up? I'm Ty. All righty. I'm Blaine. <laughs> We're not doing the accent I'm thing. I'm Malcolm. What's up, guys? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, welcome to Taste. Uh, what do you think we got today? <laughs> <laughs> what we got? They told me before what it is. Oh, uh, where? Yeah. What is it? It's um, a rare... Music. Music. Yeah, it's music. That doesn't even make sense. <laughs> All right. Da, 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 da. Black Friday. That's not music at all. Yeah, you were wrong. And this is actually music to my ears. Really? What? You a big this, Black Friday guy? You like that? Black Friday is a, a day where pretty much everything is discounted in some way. What? Is it the day before? Is it the day after at, Thanksgiving? The day after Thanksgiving. Mm, how ironic. This Do you is, like Black Friday? Uh, I don't. You really don't like shopping. What I do love about Black Friday, what I do, <laughs> what I do, <laughs> Brecky Friday, Brecky Friday, we like Brecky Friday. <laughs> so okay, what is the, what's the best deal you've ever gotten on Black Friday? <laughs> <laughs> what I do love about Black Friday though is it's the kickoff to the Christmas shopping season. Yeah. Yeah. Still don't like shopping during Christmas, but you know what I do like? Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. And yeah. the receiving of the shop. Ah, I got you, I got you. Nah, Black Friday for sure, it, it, it kicks it off and I'm just, you know. Well, I'm, we're trying to get mama something good. Exactly. Yeah. Good. yeah, let's figure out why uh, it's called Black Friday. The plague. It says here, in 1473, yep. when the rats in London brought the Black Plague, it say that was when the gifts were given because people were hurting so bad. In 1961, the city and merchants of Philadelphia attempted to improve conditions and a public relations expert recommended rebranding the days Big Friday and Big Saturday. So where are the big, the problems they were facing though? Oh, no, 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 guys, we, we missed such an important thing. Originally, the earliest use of Black Friday was whenever workers would call in sick on the day after Thanksgiving. Mm. Oh. And so their employers were like, this is the worst thing. Let's call this Let's call Black, Black Friday. Friday. But when did it become applied to like the shopping, shopping aspect? Of Black Friday, under this theory, is the beginning of the period when retailers would no longer be in the red, instead taking in the year's profits. So the earliest known published reference to this explanation occurs in the Philadelphia Inquirer, November 28th, 1981. So Black Friday, the idea is you're moving from out of the red. Is that what we're going to go with? Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Okay. I Sounds think that's great. a nice I saw a quote one time that was like, isn't it interesting that we celebrate our things, the things wow, that we've thankful, gotten, right? and then the next day people are fighting each other, getting into stores to buy new things. Um, so that's, a, I mean, I, that's an interesting take, right? I'm always on the anti-consumerism train. You yes. guys know me. Yes, <laughs> the Crocs guy. I have heard of families like going Black Friday shopping together at the okay. end of Thanksgiving, which isn't like the best quality time. But they're doing it together. You fight stronger as a unit, yes. right? No, so. no, that is true. It's just a crazy weekend, man. Cause, Cause even the next like week, it's Cyber Monday too as well. It's just like, yeah. yeah. Do you guys think that the stores are responsible for the chaos? Like when people get hurt? Yeah, like the lines, crazy lines, people like trampling. But also too, you gotta remember too as well, I've seen some viral like videos where people are messing up the stores. Like <laughs> yeah. going through the aisles and just literally. Breaking things. I've worked a Black Friday before. Oh really? Yeah. How was that? I used to work at Best Buy, I hated it. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad. I don't work at Best Buy no more. <laughs> so. Hey, if you have a crazy Black Friday story, please comment it below. As like the storekeeper, it's your job to like maintain and regulate like people mm -hmm. coming in. But then again, how you you control the masses. <laughs> for me, I don't think anybody's responsible except for the customers that are being savage to each other. And if, like, if they hurt somebody in the store, then they can get sued. It's like the purge. <laughs> There's no rules. The Black Friday purge. Give me your Xbox. I kind of disagree only because, okay, so say if like, if Best Buy only got 10 Samsung TVs and you really want a TV. Okay. So now you're itching fighting everybody to get one of those. It's like the company is kind of like making you crazy because you really want that. And now you're like, I gotta get but it. But it's like, you're a human. I gotta, you're a human though. Like, it. is this TV worth your life? Yes. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Like, it, it's kind of like, <laughs> I'm not going black for your <laughs> Like, I think I can see both sides. I think there, there is like, I think it's low for a company to only be giving minimal amount of things. And then I think it also is like responsible as, as a human 
do not try to kill yeah, somebody go into a store. <laughs> uh, Mama Marla is a smart lady and she gets on Amazon on those discount <laughs> days. So there's no need to go out there. At this point of life, my mom will not be out with all the crazies. <laughs> she will be inside. Does she shop out. online too? Yeah, she shops online, okay. but then she'll watch the news of the crazy people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she's like, look yeah, at me. She's like, <laughs> yeah, my mom's at home too. She's an excellent Christmas shopper, but she takes care of that in Way. between Black Friday. And yeah. Nice. Or maybe three months before, I don't know. I just recently you found just... out it wasn't Santa, so. <laughs> <laughs> Black Friday will continue to be a It'll thing. always be a staple in American tradition, culture. So I think it'll be a thing, but I think it's gonna become a bigger deal online shopping mm. and less retail store shopping. If discounted stuff can influence culture, then so can you. If crazy people can influence culture, anybody can. Pretty much. Anybody. <laughs> Black Friday. We love you guys.